Hello, this is Simcraft here, and I'm going to attempt a server reversal. Um, all you need is a server, un undo the server, and you have to change over the motor wires and the two wires for the what they call the pot. I'll show you now. Um, could do some tweezers as well, like this, and a steady hand. Put that on there. That's one off, and then push that to the side. Now we've got to put that. I'm going to grab the other one. And that's got to be uh, soldered. You can see that. Let's move the hand out the way. The one's off. And carefully plunk that on. That's off. Now you want that one that you took off first to go where you took the second one off. Once you've got the tweezers, grab it all tight. Let's see if we can get that connected to there. One might put a bit bit more solder. One we're gonna pull out. There we got it. It's ready to go on the side. Just want to give a a good view of it. So I've, uh, I'm doing this left-handed now. Don't matter. Come here. And then you solder that one to there. And then give it a tug. See, I'm giving it a bit of a tiny tug. Don't want to rip it off, but just uh, test. I think that one needs a little bit of a better join. So we grab that and do that one again. Looks like it's quite tight. Oh, that's tight. Uh, that's the first part. So those are two motor uh, wires have been changed round. Now the tricky bit. Let's get into shot. If you pull this up. I'll point them out if I don't manage to actually do it in one go. At least you'll know. I've got some uh, little pointers here, little whole box of watch cut. Um, that's what you need, really. You need um, these really fine screwdrivers. Is that focusing in? Anyway, can you see if I point there? And there, the two outside ones have got to be changed. That one to there, and that one to there. So you've done the motor, and once you've done that, you've reversed your uh, server. Um, you can get, um, if you search for reversing server, you can actually buy one for about um, ten pound, something like that, or more. So. But it means that having an extra uh, bits in your aircraft. Right, let's get into a better position. Right, I've timed myself for eight minutes. I've got to do this in eight minutes. Oh, my little beeper goes. So it runs out of time for the YouTube uh, video. Probably have time just to pull these two off. Should we do that one there? Get the tweezers. It's ready to come off. Steady and you can actually 
if this is too tricky use um that's one off use um see the half that wire there cut it in half cut this in half here can you see that there should we get that closer coming closer cut that in half and then splice that one with the other and the other with the other <laughs> if that makes sense what you do all you're doing is swapping that to that outside one to the other outside one so you can either do it where those these are which is a bit difficult to reach and you can melt the um, the plastic if you uh, get this wrong but if you just just cut it there you could uh, just do it outside the actual uh, plastic um, uh, container servo container as you can see I've melted a bit there actually but um, what if we've got the screws that should be alright and then I'll tape it up anyway at least that gives a good example why it'd be better just sometimes to splice it you can do it easier with um, the bigger servos there that's it came off alright and now all we do is swap those round pulling that one round and hopefully I can do this within one minute otherwise my beeper goes and that's time up but you can see the principle and what I've um, what I'm doing I think I'll need to I'm probably going to need another couple of minutes so I might call that time I'll let you know if I succeeded by commenting below or above now I'm going to just push that actually into position I might be able to do it what you could do is some little even more s smaller oh that might reach push that down a bit I think that might do it now it's best to use the tweezers I could do some, I'm going to get some smaller tweezers to do this next time and then glue that in you glue it and solder that that side I'm not going to show you now because I, I don't want to rush it I might use some little thin scissors and that will come this side there oh that scared me I thought it was... <laughs> that's time up but that's how you reverse the servo and I'll show you it working in part the next part bye for now bye